Firstly, an apology. I was so excited to get on with this game that I've played 48 minutes of the Chelsea West Ham second leg because I forgot to record. That I wasn't even I wasn't even pretending to commentate. I actually just thought I was still playing the game as I used to before I started YouTube and got straight into it. Um, so let's jump into the game and we'll do the rest of it later. Yeah, let's jump into the game. So um, it's not going well. We're one 0 down in the 48th minute. We're fairly even, but our striking team are not doing well whatsoever. Oh, we got corner here. Pyre puts the ball in. Ah, oh, quarter our clicks. This is not looking good. Sarko is out injured. Oh my god, that was a mistake there. And are you just fluffed that shot? That was the chance. Look at them all playing so crap. So yeah. It's not going well. I'm thinking about oh, Pyatt. It's not playing. Come on, Pyatt. What the hell, man? Right. I can't waste time. Can't waste time with him. Let's get on Sivolas. Dolberg. Oh, do we put on Andon? He's not fit. And he doesn't like to score goals. But he is. Let's put him on as his defensive forward as well. On support. Let's see if he can rough some people up. We'll go with that. So yeah, sorry you only could see half the game. I re didn't realise. I went to commentate at half time and then realised that I hadn't turned a camera on. Nor was I recording. So, um, sorry. But it looks like we're not going to win. <laughs> Come on, boys. Let's bring off Williams, Prot and Bree. Oh, I feel like we're going to have to do a go attacking. Come on, they've gone defensive. Yeah, attacking. Not not overload, just attacking. Shoot on sight. No, oh, that never really works, though, is it? Let's go more direct passing. Oh, God, it's a Chelsea corner. Oh, God, we didn't let that one in. That was scary. Five minutes to go. We're going overload now. Come on. Come on, boys. We're putting everything on now. Corner. Oh, caught our clicks again. <laughs> Why? Oh, we've lost one. <laughs> no. Oh. Worst of all, I didn't even. It looks like nothing happened because I didn't even bloody record the first half. Oh, Semi final. <sighs> That was ridiculous. So let's look at the schedule as if we had pretended that we weren't there. So, where do we leave you? Here, with the draw at Chelsea in the first leg. We then drew with Stoke. We then smashed Grimsby 6-1. Then couldn't find the net. Lost 1-0 to City. Lost 1-0 to Chelsea. So we're holding them back, letting them score. That Chelsea goal was in the fourth minute as well. And the Renato Sanchez one was in the sixth minute. We just don't have the firepower. We need to be able to score goals. Well, to make up for that, let's play the Southampton game and then also play the Tottenham game because I just feel bad for you guys now because you just I built it all up and I fucked it up. Ah, oh, so for so that's we've done the schedule, haven't we? This is where we're seeing two losses. We've got twelfth in the Premier League. Gap is starting to build now. There were a game behind, a couple of games behind some people. So a couple of wins, we'll need to start pushing up towards the top of the, towards the top of the table. Today will be oh god. So just as we hit the Southampton game, we'll also bring you the transfer update because that will finish. The end of the transfers will finish on the thirty first of Jan. So maybe we'll cut in and film that as well because again, I'm trying to apologise for mucking up. Oh. But we'll bring you uh, Southampton in the FA Cup fourth round and then the game at Tottenham away. So, I mean, this could be a painful episode, really, couldn't it? But we'll do that. I'll see you in four days. Okay. Oh, I lost where the camera was. Okay, so here we are. West Ham Southampton, English FA Cup fourth round because we're out of the EFL Cup. The FA Cup is the last chance we've got of getting a cup this season. So we want it. We're going for it. And we're also going to push for Europe. I've just decided. I mean, it's going to be hard, but we're going to do it. So, this is the team we're going to go for. We're going to go with Ordera at the back, Matillo left back, Saar and Oxford across the middle, Williams at right back, 
with Cibolas and Onoma in the middle. I'm thinking this might be the, the future. Cibolas and Onoma, they're both three and a half stars. It means they're, you know, they call it the best that we've got of our central midfielders. Both more, we don't, we've don't. we got one defend, but we don't need to be too defensive because we've got all these defenders at the back. So, yeah, go with me on this one. Then we've got Ayu, Payet, Zaha and Andone coming in up front because we need goals. Um, Sarko is injured. He is out for four to eight days. Dolberg just doesn't score. I'm going to have a look at the stats, I think, after this game. Maybe do a little end of um, season, end of Oh, what is it called? Transfer window update. We did sign one player. I'll show you him after this game. No, I'll show you now, actually. But he's coming at the end of the season. Is this guy? I think this is the guy. Jose Balabuena. Regen, 17-year-old Paraguayan. I mean, got good dribbling, good heading, good technique. Supposed to be a striker. Defensive forward. Don't need another defensive forward, but we've got one. Yeah, he's right down the old pecking order. So one for the future, as our director of football likes to do. One for the future. So, let's get in then. Andon struggling with match fitness. Andon is that defensive forward, actually. Talking about that problem role. I was just having a look. I don't think you can play a defensive forward when you've got one striker. He just doesn't... I feel like he needs to be... If you haven't got an attacking midfielder, fair enough, play defensive forward. Because they do the same job. Um... But let's get through this. Let's get into the game. Look at that formation. Jesus. Five at the back and a defensive midfielder. Woo. So we got to watch out for being counter-attacked here. Um, I don't think they've even got their wing backs on bloody attack. But we'll close them down anyway. Let's go for an assertive revenge. Let's just see how this goes. I'm not really sure how we're going to play this one. Because how do you break down that as a wall? Okay, 30 minutes in. First highlight. Pay over free kick. Floats it in for the second time. Zaha heads it on. And Ayu does not go in for that one when he should be. We're going to sweep all the way through to half time with one highlight. Jeez. And Donald Oxford not having great games. But that's half time. Jesus. Right. Get back out there and grab the goal. That didn't work. This is going to be a lot of fun, isn't it? Right, Matillo picks it up. Payet and Neymar. Comes forward. Look at all those defenders. Long shot from Neymar. We know he hasn't really got that in his locker. I'll show you what we'll do. We'll put the fullbacks onto support. So they get a little bit further forward. Uh, and we'll also exploit the flanks. Because they've got no wide players but those defenders. If we can get those defenders one on one again. Maybe we'll be in for something. And on playing at 6.4. Play it with a cross in. Ah, that's cleared. We don't look threatening at all really, do we? And Neymar. And Dawn. He's Oh, he got the right side. Come on, my son. Glorious stuff. So he can do it. He just doesn't like it. So here we go. I know I'll win a ball here. Look, glad he doesn't shoot for once. And on turns. Lovely little turn. And fires it past Forster. He didn't have a chance there, did he? Not one bit. Oh, Pilots picked up an injury. That's not good. Swapping with Sabolas. Swapping with Anoma. Put on Mascara. Let's also bring on Traore. Do you know, if those wingers don't start pick, kicking in, I could go to a two striker formation, possibly. Maybe it's time to relook at it again. I don't have enough strikers. I think got Dolberg, Andon, and Sarko. Right, still 1-0 now. 83 minutes. Can we hold on? Looks like... Well, they've gone attacking. With the last kick of the game. And on, can you just hold it up? A Neymar. Oh, Roberts. Can we hold on? Please hold on. Great tackle there by... Great. By Mosquera. Sound like Tony the Tiger. Sibolas. Oh, gets taken out of the game. That's got to be it though, isn't it, Ref? Blow the whistle. 
Oh, they've booted it long. What a waste. And there we go. We're sneaking, sneaking a little 1-0 win. One goal, that's what we need. Can't think of anything. Can't. Good, good win. Well done. I'm sure Southampton must be struggling in the league. So that was oh, bloody FA Cup. I didn't realise that. Vintage display in the FA Cup. So that was a nice little win, but still not great. Payet injured only for four to seven days. That's not too bad. We'll leave him to the physio. So we're now prepping for this game against Tottenham at White Hart Lane in four days. I shall see you in four days. Okay, here we are. Tottenham West Ham. Obviously, we got the sneaky 1-0 win last time. <laughs> but now we're going to White Hart Lane. This is a different story. So we're going to go in with the defensive formation. I call it the away formation, but really I now just have a defensive formation and a less defensive formation. Um, so we've got those all, def all, all the defenders on defend and the two midfielders on defend and then leaving these rest guys on attack to see what they can do. We'll put Andon... No, we'll leave him on advance forward. I don't want to change it. So the team we're going to go with is Ordero at the back, Matillo, Saar, Reed, and Bree as the back four. Anoma and Rossiter as our two deep line playmakers. Ayu, Sebolas, Zaha, and then Andon up top. So, we're hoping that's going to work. Payet is injured. That's a bit annoying. Only one to two days, but very annoying. He's very good. So, we're hoping Sebolas will do the business. But other than that, I think we are happy. Still, not don't think I'm getting the most out of these wingers. But looking at that bent, I'm very light, aren't I? On on players. <laughs> very, very light indeed. Look at this. These two are the... Oh, they're quite good though, isn't he? I forget old Batista's pretty good. So we've got these guys that could fill in if we went for a, a more midfielder-based system. Or you know, we've got an abundance of centre-backs now. Do we go five at the back with wing-backs, three in the middle, no wing support? The possibilities endless. Right, let's get into this game now. Let's not muck around. You believe Tottenham have got the quality? How dare you? He's just being rested. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, we're going to go with what we normally go with. Our new formation of closing down the attacking midfielder. We're going to tackle Lamella hard. Hoping that that gives him a bit of a kick. We're going to close down Walker. And we're going to tight mark Harry Kane. Even though that doesn't normally work. Let's close him down and tight mark him. Oh, that's the wrong person. Jesus, mine. Come on. In the game, son. Right, assertive. Right, calm. Calm. Good luck out there. Because usually they get fired up and then they get sent off and play crap. So we go calm. Keep them calm. Let's just go and play our game. See what happens. I mean, this opening highlight's gone on for too long for me. I'm a bit worried now. Oh god, they nearly scored from the opening highlight. Chase. <sighs> Not in 39 seconds. Okay, as they come forward again. <laughs> Deli Alley on the ball here. Oh, thunders that from way outside the area. That was. We were lucky that didn't go in then. Great save. Are you clears the corner? Come on, boys. Can we get the ball? Playing a little bit of attack and defend here, aren't we? Corner again to Tottenham. We're only three minutes in, and they've had three shots. And Kane scored. Okay, I can feel like this game's not going to go the same way the other one did. So the ball goes out here. Eriksen puts it back in. Kane's on his own at the back post. He's on tight marking and closing down. How has he ever got on his own at the back post? Defenders. Right. This looks like it might be a West Ham attack, but we never know. Sars got the ball here. Can he find anybody? He plays a big block to Andon, who does float it on, but there's no one there. Because you're the only striker, mate. You know that. Suarez, Deli Ali, Eric Dia, Eriksen, Lamella. Cuts inside. Look at him go. He's so quick. Suarez. Hits the byline. Oh, Lamella. Oh. Luckily, he can't head. So that was that one's helped us out. We're not playing badly. We're just not shooting. Not really doing anything, are we? Jeez Louise. I mean, I'm feeling like I have to go to the other formation just to try and get a shot. 
And Don's got the ball here. Are you right? Can we just come away? Count up. Oh, he's put a ball in. And Don said on us. 1-1. One, one. Well, maybe we hold on then. We just need, when we get that one chance to counter. Are you does well here. Puts it in. And Don does amazingly. Holds it up. Cuts three defenders out of the game. And Cebolas cannot miss from there. Game on. Ericsson with a free kick. Floats it in. Luckily we get it away. Walker's got the ball now. We've closed him down. Kane flicks it onto no one. Oh, Bree beats Deli Alley to the ball. Zaha ah, plays a crap ball forward. Deli Alley again. Okay. Tottenham are coming at us now. Ericsson, Kane. Oh, and he scored from outside the area. And then Adero was there. That must have been some bullet. We're all over the shop a bit, aren't we? Look at this defending. Kane on his own. Odero's. Ugh, can't make the save. I mean, he's the only striker. How do we keep losing him? It doesn't make sense. Bloody Tottenham. Zaha's having a shocking game. Matillo's having a shocking game. Ericsson, big ball in. Right, we've cleared it. Sabolas heads it on. And Don cannot make it. We need to look. Right, let's shorten the passing down. Oh, God, Deli Ali's just hit the bar. <sighs> now we're on. Very nervous. Right, assertive. You've been unlucky so far. There we go. Relaxed and motivated. We keep them keep them going. Let's target some players right now because this is not me. Deli Ali needs to be closed down. Because um, he's annoying me. Suarez has got the ball right. Okay, okay, let's build it up. I know, my that wasn't great, mate. Oh, Reed, good tackle. And there again, Harry Kane. Oh, great save. I don't know what we have to do to Harry Kane. Kill him. I think we need to kill him. Attilo's not having a good game. Not one bit. Do I bring on Williams? He doesn't play that side. Oh, Bree's not having a good game either, though. Let's put him on for. Okay. Um, what else do we do? Triori. Let's go Triori. Neymar's not having a good game. Oh, bollocks. Let's go for it. We're going for a free subber. We're going for free subs. We've got 30 minutes left. We're one goal down. We've replaced the fours. We've still got Matillo on the left, hoping that he. Can just hold on. Another free kick to Tottenham here. And Nietzsche Rose has got it. He's put a good ball in. It's pinging around. Luckily, it's gone outside. Walker lobs it in. Adero makes a great save. Jesus, we need to keep the ball here. Right, and on. Zibolas, that's a crap ball we could have broke then. Okay, we're having a few more shots. Not enough to really threaten, though. As Tottenham come forward again, Deli Alley, long shot. Oh dear, he's forced to make the save. How is he? How is he putting enough power behind those shots? That's what I want to know. He's got magic legs. Right, let's go for retain possession. Let's turn off to clear the balls. Retain possession. Mixed passing. Still play wide. Well, I'm just guessing now, aren't I? But if we retain possession, we're not going to give it to them. Hopefully, we'll stop playing long balls that don't go anywhere. Or Dero makes that in front of Kane. All right, 10 minutes left, or just over 10 minutes left. Come on, the boys. We're still on counter. All right, do we go for a cheeky attacking? Let's go attacking. Actually, I know what we'll do. We'll go shoot on site. More direct passing. Attacking. They won't be expecting it. We'll either lose another goal. Or the game will just run out. How dare this game do that to me. Roster plays a big ball to IU. Is this the last chance? Oh, oh God. Mosquera. Rosata. Mosquera. Don't waste too much time in the game. And Don. Traore. Oh, he's coming full time. Oh, how can he go full time then? We were dicking around though. We should have had a shot. Oh, 2-1 against Tottenham. 
as we slowly creep down 13th in the league again we're a game behind most of them but that will put us where 35th back to 11th ugh languishing in mid table ugh Ooh, but we'll call it there because this episode is probably way too long already not great in the moment we've hit another patch we had that good run look at that that was a decent one actually now we've hit the big teams not so great but we've got Liverpool so we've got Liverpool, Leicester, Wolves we've got Oxford in the 5th round of the FA Cup can't remember if I told you that probably not so we will go and play a fair few games offline for 5-ish who do we want to come back for it's going to be a, oh, before the end of the season maybe we'll do one, two, three, four. maybe we'll just do Oxford we'll do the FA Cup and we'll do Fulham and then we'll see because that might put one or two episodes left in there yeah let's do the FA Cup and Fulham so we'll come back for the Oxford game in four games not long to wait I mean for you it's just the next day in the schedule but for me it's not long so four games Wolves and Wolves Oxford and then Fulham in the Premier League hopefully you're back to winning ways but we will leave it there thank you very much for watching if you have enjoyed the video please do smash the like button if you are new to the channel please do subscribe otherwise I shall see you next time have a good evening bye bye